Hi Jean, Phil Beaver here from the Wilderness Club. Quick recap on our lesson uh, this morning. So we've run through here as you take the club away. Backswing's good here, hinges through the right forearm. Gets to the top in a nice position there. Left arm's great. If we look at this chap here on the right, a similar position there. His club's pointing a different way, but the arms are, you know, the left arm is in a good slot. You can see that with yours. Can't draw straight lines. There you go, good slot. Right elbow's pointed to the floor, so it's all okay. This is where things need a little change. As if we draw a line there, we're going to see your hand stay above this red line as you're coming down here. We can see the shafts cutting through your left forearm. And your hands are above this red line. If we draw a line on this guy's swing uh, from the butt, the club to the ball, like we did with yours, you're going to see his hands stay on that line to go slightly left of that line. So his club is attacking through his right forearm. We can see that there. And there's yours. So what that's happening with yours, Gene, is you're just coming slightly what we call across the ball. We can see that now here. The club head is to the right of the ball coming into impact. Uh, with this guy here on the right, we can see his club head is always to the left of the ball. So it just means that your swing is only going to ever swing left and across, which is going to put little weak cuts on it. Uh, and this guy, Matt Every here, he's swinging from the right and he's going to hit little soft draws. So you said you'd lost power, and this is the reason why. If you relate it to tennis, it's almost as if you're hitting drop shots at the net. You know, your club goes outside the line, cut across the ball to cut the legs underneath it, and that's what you're doing in your golf swing. So, well, if we relate it to the tennis shot, it's a very weak shot, and that's what we get with your golf swing. So we just worked hard on trying to feel that your arms went a little bit more behind on the way down, and that got the club thing into the slot for you, and then... As you gain, start to gain some confidence, you could actually rotate over the shot and start to hit it a little bit harder. With the position you're currently in, you can't rotate because if you did, every single shot would finish over here quite a long way to the left. Um, so you stopped turning, but now the club's getting in a good position. I'm hoping the body will start to turn and you can start to hit it harder and harder and trust it. Thanks a lot, Gene.